All right, guys, coming up in today's video, we're gonna discuss the top 10 buildings which have hit over $1,000 per square foot in the Toronto market, coming up next. All right, guys, Michael Jacobs back here, and as I said, we are talking about the top 10 buildings, condo buildings that have hit over $1,000 per square foot. These are stats from 2017, the Toronto Real Estate Board. This was originally zucasa.com just released this article. So they did the, the information. I'll put the article below. Make sure you check it out. Um, but coming in, basically the premise was had to be 416 area code. They looked at over 600 buildings, had to have at least five transactions in the year. And uh, here's what they got. So coming in number 11, or sorry, number 12 is the Aurora building which hit $1,004, which is on 386, 388 Young Street. Coming in number 11, you have the Nicholas Residence, which is uh, 75 St. Nicholas Street, which hit $1,012. Starting in at number 10, we have the Murano, which is at 38 Granville Street, which hit $1,013 per square foot. Coming in at number 9, you have the Theatre Park Building, which is 224 King Street West, and that hit $1,038 per square foot. Coming in at number eight, the Shangri-La, which is located at 180 University Avenue, which hit $1,040. Coming in at number seven, which is tied, um, same square footage, uh, price per square foot, which is 1,040, was the Prince Arthur, which is 38 Avenue Road. Coming in at number six, you have pairs on the avenue, which is 170 Avenue Road, which came in at $1,062. Number five, the residence at the Ritz Carlton, which was 183rd Wellington Street West, and that came in at $1,076 per square foot. Number four, Karma Condos at 15 Grenville Street, $1,121. So we hit over 1,100 there. Number three, you had one Bedford which is One Bedford Road, $1,231 per square foot. Number two, you got the Four Seasons Residence, which is 55 Scholar Street, which came in at $1,296 per square foot. We're definitely not there. Coming to number one, the U Condos, which is 65 St. Mary Street and 1080 Bay Street, which came in at a whopping $1,319 per square foot, guys. There you have it. As you notice, all these uh, properties are located within the same cluster. Um, so no surprise there, but expect these prices to continue to go up and definitely surrounding buildings to carry you know, the same weight. Like, comment, share, guys. Uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Take care.